All right. All right, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Axiom Verge. Here on my channel, Idle Wisdom. All right. We rejoined Trace here. And we were in, what is it? Oh, I don't remember what this place is called. Ukinna. And if you recall, last episode, we found Ophelia, one of the Rusalka. And she helped us get back together again after he, Trace was being succumb, you know, I guess succumbing to the toxin. So what's his face? This Athetas' toxin. And we were having the freak out. So then we fought a boss battle against someone who looked like Trace. Or something or other. I don't know. There's Ophelia again. Looking all interesting. A little bit different. One of the ways she's different, of course, is that she's a straight on, you know, front... picture rather than the the side portrait view profile view I guess anyways oh wait what do we have here a health node ah oh, nice that's not a health node fragment of course that is a full health node looks like there's a way to go oh, there oh geez that was real good that's my normal trick Okay, so we have two ways to go. Okay, well, this way with the funky grass. Whoa. Let's see what the other way has for us. No. Oh, can I not get in there? Let's see, okay. Oh yes, I can. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, those those grasses, those those shrubberies, they hurt you. They drain your life. When they go. Yeah, hey, uh, looks like there's another, like a piece of a journal or something. Oh, jeez. Let's see. How are we gonna? Aha! Oh, I wonder. Can I? No, wrong button. There. Yeah. No, no, no. Oh, jeez. Aha. All right. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Oh, another message that's in some. Sudran language of some sort. See, it's it's like it's like this, isn't it? Yes, it is. It's like that. It's not the dialect or the language that we have the translation notes for. Well, that's annoying. But oh well, we got it. So once we have a way to translate that, we will do it. Ah, there we are. Waha, and we can hear that little drone just chilling. I think that's the drone that, maybe that's the drone that saved our bacon and dragged us to Ophelia. Yeah, it was weird, you know, it's like we were fighting. Oh, dang, blast it. All right, whatever. Is there anything over here? Yeah, leave me alone. Meow, meow. Is there any reason for it to even go over here? Huh, no, there isn't. That I can see, anyway. Ha! 
Haha. I love the music right here, it's really cool. Never mind, dude. There, I'm gonna get you anyway. Out of principle. Let's see. We're like right near where we fought before. Can we get up here? Yes, we can. Yes, we can. But we can't do anything more here for now, anyways. Unless. Unless. Okay. I just want to see if we can. Because we were. When Tra um, Trace was having that. Feeling all sick. He couldn't summon the drone. So I was wondering if it was still. Summonable or not. But it is. And that's where we were fighting before. Oh, that's weird. Look at that. That's some funky stuff right there. No, it doesn't do nothing. Hello? Huh, weird. I remember that thing, but I don't remember what it does. Uh-oh, this is red. Huh. Weird. I think we were not in our right mind last time we came through there. <laughs> oh, hey. Okay, so then where do we go now? That's a great question. Hmm. I guess we go down. It'll be interesting to see what this area is actually like when we're not, you know, tripping. Yeah, take that. All right. Ah! Oh my goodness, that started on me. Well, I did not mean to go back. Darn nation. Darn nation. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm not playing with you guys. You guys are mean and rude. Mean and rude. Especially mean. Oh, jeez. Haha, -ha, I got something for you. Oh. I guess I don't have anything for him. I don't have nothing for him. Ugh. <laughs> That's what I thought. Oh, that's right, then they just produce life. I forgot about that. That's pretty cool. When you corrupt them, all they do is they... they Those little Healy pods. Healy sparkles. <laughs> yep. It's a good trick. If you remember it. There we are. All healed up. All healed. Let's make sure there's nothing here. Yeah, all the weird stuff that we saw is not in... not evidenced at all. Okay. Yeah, no. Ah! Ooh, I wonder what happens if we... What does that do to him? Eh, yeah, big deal. Maybe it just makes him slow. Oh, that's probably what it is. Makes him maybe slower? I don't know. Whatever. Wow, all the weird stuff. Not here. <laughs> Those things are still here.
Let's turn this back on. Those are still kind of a pain. Huh, how do we get up here? Nope, nothing. That's interesting. <laughs> Dang it. They still take a decent chuck of chunk of Haha. But they give a lot of life back. Nope. It's worth trying. Never know unless you try, as Jack Burton says. As Jack Burton says. I don't know. I don't know if it, I don't know if it's better to use the disruptor on them or not. And what does this lead us to? Oh man, come on. We can't get that yet. Wait. Can I? Hmm. Ah. Now, I don't think I can get it yet. Dang it. I'm never going to remember that's here. <laughs> oh, jeez. Got him. Ooh, the modified lab coat. Modified lab coat. The trench coat. Oh, yeah. We already have that. Double tap in any direction to teleport. Now, this is cool. Now, this is exactly what we needed. Now, we got a freaking cool brown coat. I mean, if you're a... See? Like that. This is what we've been needing. Power node fragment. Okay, number four out of six. And it's way easier to warp with this than it is with the regular coat. By a large margin, in fact. I... No, I... Hmm, I don't know. Now watch. See? You can do all sorts of cool warping. Now, do we need to go back up? That's my question. Should we go back up? Or keep going back down? I, I I expect it in some sense it doesn't. Eh. We'll go down. We'll come back. We'll have to. Woohoo! Yeah. Yeah. Well, that was definitely the upgrade we needed, for reals. On the realio. We can probably even make it up there. Yep, see? Right like that. Right like that. Oh, geez. It's one of these. Oh, look at that. What is it? What is it? Health node fragment. What did he... Was that just there? Did he turn into that? Gotta be careful. Those things are dangerous. They're not dangerous once... Like, they're pretty weak once you... You alter them. Wow, they just pop. Ah, here we are. Yeah! Hey, uh, and this has been a cool episode so far. Really fun. The Breach. Our best conjecture thus far is that it is a forced relinking of the lattices underlying adjacent universes. The breach tractor then has some capacity to shift the points at which the lattices link. The region beyond 
the breach remains intact as when the breach recedes. The atmosphere and surrounding ocean don't encounter a vacuum in its absence, though there is a strong disturbance in the currents once the two sides meet again. Outside of a breach elevator, passing through the breach can be fatal. The Sudrans use this as a makeshift shield to keep out intruders, or as in our case, to keep something else trapped in. Based on their writings, it seems that the Sudrans have long ago lost a scientific understanding of, the breach tr of what the breach truly is, perceiving it as an intense meteorological phenomenon rather than as a div divider between worlds. A7 hypothesized that the breach itself is invisible and that the effect what we see in the sky is in fact a protective field of microscopic elements covering the frayed ends. Alright, wow. So that the breach is a separate separation between parallel universes he's saying? Or multiple universes, different universes? And the uh, the breach attractor, the breach elevator and all that can be used as a way to keep... Okay, we're... We just came that way. Keep people out or in. Keep people out or keep people in. Oh, look, right there. I remember this. I don't know what you do here. Let me see. I don't get it. I never understand what's going on here. How about you? Ah, I don't know. Nope. I, I've never understood what the point of that was. Okay, let's see. We can go this way. And then we can just jump right through there. Let's see. That would lead us back down to the that long hallway level with the the head that goes back and forth. So you can just jump and then shift, which is really helpful. Oh, this area. This is a dangerous area. I may not be able to get past here yet. I don't know, who knows? Hee hee. Take that. Hmm. Let me see. Hold on. No, no. No, no. No, no. Ah. Hold on two seconds, sorry. My computer is being weird. See, you can warp up like that. All right. <laughs> cool. 
pretty cool area. Cool music. Oh, here's that corruption. I don't think we can do anything with it yet. Hmm. Don't pass it up. I should be corrupting those things. Oh wait, there's a... Yeah, right, nope, nope, nope. Oh, it's right here, isn't it? Huh, we cannot get in there yet. Huh, interesting. Well, you know, that's fine. We'll get there later. Yeah, I should be not passing up corrupting them so I can get the the helipods on them. The helipods, it's a technical term. I say as I don't get the helipods. Ah, see? More corruption. Nope. Doesn't do anything to it. I think we're gonna have to come back here again later. Woohoo! Oh, these are interesting. Oh, I think there's a bad news bear in here somewhere. Yep! Oh, you punk. Oh, I think we're toast. Yep, I'm toast. Dang, blast it. Ah, oh, that's... Annoying, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> well, that was, um... Annoying, but, you know, we're right back here, where we were. Which is actually not bad. Not bad at all. We made actually some pretty good progress. So I think I'm gonna call it today, here. And next time, we will continue on and see where we can get with a, this new um, trench coat with its super warping of pow powers. I think maybe we'll go to the left. Here, I see, like, I'm pointing, like, to my TV. That's all you can see that. <laughs> but I think there's some, maybe something we can do there. And if not, we can go back up again to where we were with Ophelia, because I think maybe we can make use of this new warping power. And if not, we will continue on, and I'll try not to, you know, just suck it up. As badly. <laughs> Alright, well thank you for joining me on this episode of my Let's Play of Axiom Verge. And take care, y'all.